And another thing, in reverence to the uh, Westwood Police Department video and the satellite controller in Westwood or the dirty cop that tried to tried to murder me in Westwood, accusing me of things when they were trying to play weeble wobble shit with their satellite in Westwood in reverence to that court judge or these FBI agents that was trying to steal my penis. Don't forget, I lived in my mother and father's mansions in Beverly Hills growing up and in other mansions in, around the country with my mother and father when I was growing up. And I've been a celebrity since I was born. And the Royal Protocol is in California, too. So in reverence to the satellite man pushing down on me, or since then, they've damaged my front teeth, which causes hyperventilation. When you speak and, you know, air comes out too fast, that's like a hyperventilation. You have to catch your breath and shit like that. But in reverence to Westwood, California... When they had pulled me over illegally. Don't forget, I was born with Royal Diplomatic Immunity, man. So you pulling me over and you lied. We were driving down Westwood and uh, no, I wasn't drunk or anything like that. And the cop said, he, he said, you made a left turn from the right lane. No, I didn't. We said, hey, hey, girls. There were some girls out on the sidewalk there. It was like, hey, how you, guys, how you girls doing? You know, we were driving down the street. And then these cops pulled us over. I don't know. You have to check the the uh, transcripts of that police station or which cop was trying to frame me. And they zapped me on the highway when I was driving to California on the 10 freeway one of the times. From one of the times I, I had to drive from Indiana to California, they zapped me. And there was like a yellow Datsun pickup truck or something that was on the highway. And you might have to check the satellite surveillance on that. Like some people had caught these people trying to murder me uh, from satellite in California too. But you know, in reverence to the information, check the Westwood videotapes of the police station when they had all these cops making up lies, uh, trying to accuse me. And then this other cop came over or something and said, no, nah, leave him alone. You know, because I almost hyperventilated and died right there in the police station in Westwood, California. And they illegally pulled me over and made up lies. Like, they, I don't know if those cops was gay, but then they kept stalking me for a little while and they were trying to frame me for something because they were trying to get out of their violations of trying to steal uh, my penis or them trying to steal my identity or them trying to run me out of town. They were working for somebody. And don't forget, I own my mother and father's mansions and properties in Beverly Hills. So in reference to the information... These cops, they were either gay cops, and they were stalking me after that. Some of these people were trying to frame me when they might have been involved in the murder of my mother in 93. <clears throat> so in reference to that information, they need to, they're choking me right now. That's another $25 trillion lawsuit. So in reference to these uh, government people, that had conspired against me in Los Angeles, all those people have to be apprehended. Those dirty cops. My royal diplomatic immunity is in California too, man. So they have to check back the information. They tried to accuse me of drugs too. Like I was driving down the street and this cop pulled me over saying he thought he smelled drugs. Not from my vehicle. He even got into my vehicle and started snooping around being a nosy motherfucker. I've never done drugs. But he said he smelt drugs when he passed me on Fountain Avenue and then pulled me over in the driveway of the apartment complex and they stole my fingerprints off the hood of their car and they probably tried to make forgeries to steal mansion properties or businesses. Don't forget, everything you've done to my teeth, government man, you're going to be judged on the x-rays. Of 100% perfect teeth. And I'm not going to toy with you, man. If we can get the death penalty on you or anybody else that's damaged my teeth, then that's what you're going to get. Or life in a prison, man. You've caused a problem for my life every second of every day. My face is fractured. My teeth are damaged. It's hard to chew bubble gum, man. And basic information. And I have never done drugs. And I'm not going to play your shit, man. 
any of you people, no matter who the fuck you are trying to accuse me of drugs, or your people zapping me or terrorizing my fucking life, it's more lawsuits every fucking day, man. There's interest on all those trillion dollar plus lawsuits too.